Sehr gut. Sehr gut. Oh, wow. <coughs> That's not bad. And now for the echo. And now for the echo. I guess that sounds all right. I was curious. He does kind of look like Squall, doesn't he? He does kind of look like Squall, doesn't he? Oh my god, is, is it really, uh, is, is, Oh yeah, it's at 41, no shit. No wonder that Discord sound blew your fucking ears off. Okay. Where's... hang on, no, not you, here's this. Um, what am I doing? Turn the volume. Turn my speaker back on. There we go. Okay. Alright. I'm glad to hear that. Man, the only Fallout game I've actually played is, uh... <laughs> the mobile one. And, uh, even that one made me nervous as shit. Because all I really wanted to do was make a society and, like, you know, get get people hooking up and shit. Shelter, that's the one, yeah. Literally just in it for the shipping aspect. But, like, there was a budget and resources and shit, and I was just not into that at some point. So I was kind of torn because, uh, I don't know who to do first in the Soul Chronicle. Um... Like, I know a lot of us like Sophitia. Um, but I kind of like, I don't like doing the, you know, I, I'm more of a, like, save the best and savor it later sort of thing. Um. So, uh, I kind of don't want to do Sophitia first. Even though I think that's like all who we would want to see first, except for well, I guess Dora would want to see Siegfried first. 
We could probably do Siegfried first. It might not be a bad place to start, considering he is a central character. So, like, and fun fact, uh, Mission Libra of Soul, if we ever wanted to, like, do the Captain Harry adventure, we could totally do that. And all of the horror and comedy that it would bring. So, let's go on into Soul Chronicle. I am still, he could. Um, and it's got like a karma meter too. Oh shit, my phone is at 1% battery. Let me plug it in real quick. I mean, the other option is because there is a, as you can see at the top here, that I currently have selected. There is a main story um, that we could just do first and work on that, but that that means you know. Only focusing on a handful of characters at first. So, I don't know. I didn't really have a plan going into this, which is probably a bad thing, but like, you know, how do we f how do we feel about that? Do we want to do the main story first? <laughs> I can do Geralt's Geralt's story. Uh, technically. I kind of like, I don't know, I don't, I don't know that I feel like we should do the non-canon one first. Should we do the main story? Would that like be, would that be helpful to people? I don't know. I should have thought this out better, but I, I didn't. There are a couple I won't, I won't do first. Let me, let me, let me start with that maybe. Um, I wouldn't do Keelik, Zhanghua, um, Sophia, Geralt, or Cassandra first. Or, I guess, I guess not Nightmare? I don't know. <clears throat> oh my god, what is going on in my sinuses? Oh!
I have not played Stardew. I don't... I don't know. Stardew is a game that traditionally has kind of annoyed me because everybody loves it so much. Alright, you know, we're going to do main story first. Just, just because, I guess. Because I, nobody's saying anything, so whatever. Well, this is kind of telling us the actual story. Also, hi, Sir Spectres. Hello. How are you? This is what happened in the game Soul Blade. Well, at least he wasn't prejudiced. By Sophia, best girl. Hephaestus? Who says that? I'm really glad we have Zebnus here to, uh, Wow, they gave Siegfried a, a short-haired uh, model. Well, they just skipped over the entirety of Legends, so that's a thing. Hello there. Thanks for the follow, Sir Spectres. That does sound weird. This game has some nice art, by the way. That's not Kid Icarus at all.
I don't know in what world that's a mirror, but okay. Hello, Wendy Lee. Really? Surprised? Well, there's more. It's weird that I know her as Lynn. Because she's been in a lot of stuff lately. It has nice art, but the uh, that's where the budget went, so... Oh, I think we have to fight now, right? Yep. Hey, there's gameplay. So how's everyone doing and all? How was your weekends? Just gonna beat this disciple up. Yeah, I'm still all nasally and shit myself, so I know how that is. I think it's more of an allergies thing, honestly, because our weather has been... Uh-oh. She in trouble. I love how they spell out her weird grunts. Oh. Game over, man.
Oh yeah, sure. You can always do that. That's like that's no problem. I gotta try and record more on Tuesday. Hopefully, I'm not. I have to decide which topics to cover because I have a list. I mean, that's life, man. More like a squall. Yeah, Dora, that's definitely a thing. But it's also like... I don't know how exactly they would do that. But one of the things you have to remember... Is, uh... This is... Well, apart from the Soul Calibur V, which was its own thing. <laughs> a, like a fucking bear. That's probably Cocaine Bear. Um, that's a joke only someone playing this in 2023 would make. Um, but, uh... What was I going to say? Yeah. Like, man. What was I going to say? Yeah, Soul Calibur did not have very good... What the... That's bloody Jill, that is. I wonder if I had this this way last like when I first played this story because I forgot that this happened. Battle two. Fight. 
This is this is non-canon. Jill would kick his ass. Just kidding. Something you could definitely learn from Jill. Anyways, like I was saying, um, yeah, the previous Soul Calibur games did not have story like this at all. Um, you basically only got tidbits, or you had to read it in like unlockable profiles, which was annoying as shit. Um, so like this is actually like really high budget and well thought out it's like one of the first times these characters had actual stories you know like that really couldn't have been a fight it's a little bit weird where they decide to put fights In fairness, the story is pretty, like, I don't know. I know I praised it, but I I really have a lot more praise for the characters themselves than, like, their stories. You can turn it up so at least the voices can be heard a little bit better. Yeah, it's just weird how they, uh, like, even prior to this, had so really, uh... Yeah. Guess you're in luck, because that's where we're going. But I warned you, our ship ain't what you call luxurious. I don't care. As oh, balls. God damn it. So, can I join you? I hate... You just click sure, on this thing, and it's like, uh, squares? End up costing you a pretty penny. <laughs> huh? Oi, driver! Where's you going? This ain't the way to the dock. Huh? You deaf or something? What the? He's been consumed by evil. I'll kill you! Damn. You leave me no choice. There, maybe that'll be easier to see the text.
you're safe, B. Even us pirates ain't safe from bandits when we's on land. When we's on land? What the frick? Sure. That was no ordinary bandit. It takes me back to that night. The shadow upon my soul. Chung Lin. Lucina and Sora? Dude, I would love to see a good Sora main. As the uh, basic template Fire Emblem characters go, I think Roy is my favorite. Although I do love playing Krom, actually. Because Krom has Aether, and that's just really good. So, you're the guy who saved one of our own? On behalf of our captain, Maxi, I welcome you aboard. <laughs> but Why is that funny to that mirror from you till we had landed. Sound reasonable? This is one thing I can't give you. Why not? I'm just gonna hold on to it. It ain't like it's payment for your ride or nothing. This is a keepsake from my sister. A keepsake, eh? Hey, we're just gonna hold one of your possessions. You know, we're not shady at all. I don't know what I've ever done if it <laughs> Okay. I like you. I'll go speak to Maxie for you. You're one of us now. Thank you. Don't mention it. <laughs> it seems the captain has the trust of his crew. He ain't been back since he stepped on land. Probably got stuck at the bottom of the glass. <laughs> what the? <clears throat> I find that surprising actually, but also not surprising because the DLC is like a thing. I don't know, Keely just has like some pirate vibes, that's all. Lizard man! Oh god, I love that. look at how green he is! My like, dude. Into the drink. People want to ban Steve? Well, of course they do. Like, I want y'all. I have, I have, I have a. Uh, let's do some interactivity right now. For all the folks at home, take a moment right now and just say, just say it with me. Say, Lizard Man. It's very fun to say. Lizard man. You know, here we fight the lizard, lizard man, lizard man. Oh, this one has like broader shoulders than the last couple. Lizard man. Take a drink every time we see that picture of uh, Keelik and Jean Lin. You'll be drunk soon. <laughs> right? Bob 
abomination. How dare he harm my family? Ha Cap, this is bad. <laughs> Take a drink. Take a drink, anyone. Uh, take a drink anytime anyone like cradles a dying person in this story apparently. It's amazing how well Astaroth actually Stop talks. Right there. What? What's with this guy? We gotta oh, fight shit. him too. He, he's one of us. Okay, so I won't kill him. Just save your strength. Keelix gone beast mode. He's like Gohan Beast, but not without the Gohan. Also, we're fighting him with a pair of nunchucks, by the way. Like Berserk Sykes, she says, swimming. I can think of one game too, Claxi, and that would be spoilers. But I also don't know how spoilers it is because it's kind of an old game. Right now. Oh no, you blocked me. Calm down, sir. Wear your mirror. I didn't have better things to do. It's more than just a fashion statement. Oh no, Damn. not my ship. Got my work cut out for me. I guess Maxi lost his pad. The option I've got is to kill him. You can thank Cam. Adios, Cam. Character designs are really take cool. A, take a kill quest. It's like you said, he's one of us. And you know, those guys will be back for him. We will get our revenge. It's the only reason I live for now. <laughs> I wish I could define myself based on a moment like that. The only reason I live is for this thing that happened two seconds ago. Zeno Gears looking dead. motherfucker. Maxi? I have no idea what you're talking about. Even so, what's the deal? What? I thought all warriors knew you have to strike first. What are you fucking Cobra Kai? Looks like we're done talking. I may look easy going, but I never back down from a challenge. I mean yes, Dora, but it's you're like it's weird to say better. it that way. I will honor you with a duel. <laughs> Don't blame me if you get I mean, Mitsurugi looks kind of hot in his art, I'm not gonna lie.
Oh my god. Maturity, you're making me dizzy. Monk Pirate Samurai Trio. Dora's already got her own version of the game going on here. Which one is the one with Link? Uh, so two, uh, Soul Calibur two is the one with Link, only on GameCube, of course. Um, and Soul Calibur four is the one with Darth Vader, Yoda, and The Apprentice. You sound so young. Seriously, you may want to rethink your life choices. Well, if you seek Soul Edge, the most powerful weapon ever. You're bound to attract trouble, right? Soul Edge? We've got our own beef with that. Well, this is quite a coincidence. Let me just give you this word of advice. Beware of the ninja Taki. Soul she Edge has and great her go tips. hand in hand. Sorry, I can't. Sorry. So long. Look, Soul Calibur has gotten some weird ass guests in it. The, no the PSP one had uh, Kratos flight. from God of okay, War. This one has Geralt and 2B from so Near Automata. Just try not to overdo it, okay, Maxie? Uh, this uh, game almost had Noctis in it anything, from Xeno, uh, Xenoblade. <laughs> this game almost had Noctis in it from... Um, Dante was almost in one of these games. I forget which one it was. Um, but yeah, Noctis from Final Fantasy XV was almost in this game, but they were working on Tekken at the time, so they put him in Tekken instead, which was a weird thing. Yeah, I forget what the deal was. And I forget which one he was supposed to be. I think it was three, maybe. I remember hearing that somewhere. Oh, look at this chick. Shang Tsu style sword technique? Shang Lin? Why is he staring? They could be twins. Huh? Ling Shang Tsu? I've heard of it. My mother might have trained there when she was younger. Man, she also voiced by Wendy Lee. Wow. Also, hi, Grand yeah, Spectre. I am. You move very uh, gracefully. Are you traveling somewhere? Yeah, I'm heading west. Really? Me too. Heading west? Wait, what is Sun? Doing, is he Sun Wukong? I just, you know, happen to be passing through. I see. It must be fate. <laughs> and <laughs> take a drink. Take a drink. Someone you want to bring along? <laughs> I can't take my eye off you for five seconds, can I? No, it's not. We're going in the same direction. The more the merrier. Thanks. He's kind of Goku. I, uh, okay.
He look, Maxie's into it. He's not. He's not like he doesn't mind her coming in and like adding something to their bromance. He's the wielder of Soul Edge? If my investigations are correct, yes. Kind of an over-the-top name, isn't it? Uh... Ooh, okay. organ music. Let's go over everything. They're banding together. Because Mitsurugi doesn't join anyone. He's friends with the jerk I'm after. A real piece of work called Astaroth. More like Astaroth. Freak, and a woman called Ivy, who uses a whip sword. Ivy. That's one hell of a like crew. Princess Ivy? Who rides a dragon and casts fire spells at people? Whole army. Nightmares are like phantoms. And where's a fucking doily on sight. her head? But like it's a rigid? What do they want? Who knows? Kill it. Doesn't your master know anything about all this? I don't know. Well, that's just great. Pout. Still. Whatever we do, I think our paths will cross at some point. Yeah, at some point. Great. Right? I'm like, I don't even know what Maxie did before this game. Oh hey, I think this is a cameo from one of Dora's favorite characters. It does strike me. He does not feel like a captain. He needs a hat. And a coat. There he is. There's the boy. Hmm. The order stands as it was. Wearing his scouter. Understood. I will make contact shortly. Oh, this actually is like a 3D cutscene. Hello. Show me what you got. What? If this is all you have, then your fate is to die here. Absolutely. Yeah, the little Celeste animation is there because A, I like Celeste I and mean, she's part of the reason why I'm still streaming today, so um And also because it lets people know when the stream is lagging. So like even if the game image is static and chat is static, there's always something on the screen moving. So if she stops, you know there's a problem. Somewhere. Look at that little tap to his head.
Uh, no, I mean, we so saw your message about Celeste. I, will tell you one thing. I just talked about it later. Yes, fine. And there Tell me, he Killick, grows. Who exactly are you? People there seem he out grows to get you. again. I apologize for getting you involved in all this. Stop acting so formal. <laughs> fine. I'll open up first. I've been hiding something from you. I'm searching for Soul Edge too. Really? My country, the Ming Empire. You know it, right? It's going through some hard times. Violence is the norm. In the hope of saving our land, the Emperor asked me to Can someone like quote Bill Words Soul about China right now? Also known as Soul Edge. So that's what I'm trying to do. I may not be ah, okay. one, but I'm a soldier. <sighs> Surprised? She's Mulan. Well, it means I've been involved in this from the start. <laughs> You're the first person I've told. It was supposed to be an Imperial secret. Does that affect things between us? Yeah, they could at least give him some lip flaps, you know what I'm saying? Sorry. I knew some time ago I would have to tell you everything. So I'll just say it. Okay. If you say so, it must be true. I thought it was a little strange. How could that so-called hero sword save our land? Okay, that settles it. I'm gonna stick with you, Killick. What? My duty is important to me, but I want to know the truth. I want to see it for myself. Uh... Okay. With Maxie, too, of course. No ifs, ands, or buts. What have I gotten myself into? I guess it's fate. Don't you worry about that. I mean, I Suikoden 2 has a lot of characters. But my mother always said, fate is carved with your own hands. Why did you say that? Um, I'm kidding? Oh, right. <laughs> Never mind, then. It's like, it's like that movie. It's the skateboard kid. Hey, I'm surprised we didn't flash back to his, his him holding the whatever her name is. I already forgot about it. Are we in Greece? Um, yes, we're in Greece. Yes. The is best girl. Look at her. She looks really uh, fucking no. young for some reason. It's just you look a little sad. Oh, really? <laughs> Pardon me, but are you a traveler? Well, uh, you could say that. I am too. I mean, I am from this town. I came to this shrine to pray before embarking on my journey. You... you're a warrior, aren't you? I'm just sitting on yes. the stairs here, man. I was too. I fought for the longest time. It is why I can never simply pass by someone with as forlorn a countenance as yours. Oh, I want to talk about that. There is something I must do. When you find a reason to fight, you find a reason to punish yourself. I was the same. There are some things we are powerless to do anything about. People speak of fate, but I wonder if there is worth in sacrificing yourself for it. I feel so uncertain. The darkness of the soul can be troubling. It's always with me, like a real shadow. Are they having an actual conversation right now, or are they in two different conversations spliced together? I can't just forget the past in order to save myself. It is no bad thing to keep hold of the past. Those dear to you will always be in your memories, still. Oh, hello. If you ask me. Can we just like Photoshop me into the right half of this <laughs> image right now? She's married, Funk. You can't. Actually, actually, she's not married at this point. I have to go. Are you okay? Pain does indeed lie in the past. Weird that I she does not have a scar on her chest, though. As will I. We'll learn more about Those that in Sophia's story. Here and now. Well, there's her cameo in the main story. The Fuma Ninja, oh boy. I'm pretty sure there are only 20 
chapters in this, so we're like almost there. It should be. Oops. Look out. Oh. I was just about to ask what happened to Maxie. He's been kind of quiet. What the? So you made it this far. Huh? Why? Is that all it takes to hobble you? Hobble. If so, do you honestly think you can take <laughs> Or <this> not? <laughs> Ah, all right. See you, Classy. Shenghua is pretty cute. I do like. I do like her. She's underrated in my book. How can she stand up to Boob Ninja, though? That's the real question, right? Look at the Boob Ninja. What a lovely singing voice. It sounds really different when she's fighting. Beat her with a kick to the face. Hey. Huh? There's something strange about that sword. How do you like this? Whoa! What? What's wrong? Had enough? Oh shit, orcs are near. So you controlled the evil yourself. Fair enough. Just take care. It, is that because of my boob joke, Gran, or do you really have a thought there? The instant you give yourself over to your shadow, I'll kill you. Persona! You've been warned. There's no escape from a ninja with the power to seal. The power to seal. Is she gonna sing Kiss by a Rose? Are you okay, Killick? Yeah, I knew pursuing Soul Edge would be no easy task, but... <sighs> they don't explain it very well, but Taki's actually not evil. She's actually good. Once we get through this forest. Yep. It's the date we've all been waiting for. Who knows? Might go well. Oh, well, they're going on a date? I just don't want to deal with any more freaks. One lizard's enough for me. Lizard man. Huh? Lizard. Oh, there's lizard man. Speak of the devil. Maxi, don't do anything rash. What the? What are you both doing? Cheap shot. Who are you anyway? You've got 
Oh, there she is. Man, we've got two boobs in a row. I like how she has two very different hairstyles. You're no match for me. Frickin' Bayonetta over here. Bluster doesn't, but hmm. Butster doesn't either because I was kicking her bare ass. Okay? I'd say that was enough. Don't let him see your boobs. Fulfilled my duty. If you want to pursue nightmare, I don't care. Do as you please. Hey, hold on. And once more, the boobs. <laughs> Look out of our life. I gotta stop making boob jokes, please. You can't go on with your leg like that. No need to sweat it. Sweat the lake. Trap. Well, isn't this just peachy? <sighs> Sounds like this trap is the pits. <laughs> so the reports were true. What sort of idiot tried to enter a castle through the front? <laughs> Leave him to me. I've been looking forward to smacking down this freak. <laughs> so you came here to die. What's this? Are you here to help us? This way. Hurry. Um, but what about Maxie? I'm fine. Just go. Impudent fools! You cannot escape me! Smack him with his nunchuck. Right oh my god. It is just the most ridiculous thing. Astaroth has giant axe, and Maxi, he's got some nunchucks. <laughs> I'll have revenge for my family. Putrid maggot, you're dead now. Battle one. Why does that never work?
Is it over? How did you kill him with nunchucks? Oh, you didn't. Well, that's what you get for using fucking nunchucks. You dingus. The hell did you do? What the hell did he do? Shove it up his ass? <laughs> Everyone, Cam, this was for you. Literally, the only way you could have won. <laughs> Just fucking picture him now. Oh god. You fucking nunchucks, man. What a badass design. Nightmare always looks fucking good. How are you going to beat Armor Boy with a stick, Keelik? Why is Zhang Hua the only one who wears it, who, who wields an actually deadly weapon? These are the questions that I have about the about this cast. The designs in 4 are so fucking over the top. Like, for better or for- like, I'm not saying that's a bad thing, but they really are. character to fight so he can just demolish your health bar. Finally 
nearly over? Oh god, that's awful. That's awful, but it's kind of it's <laughs> it's kind of accurate, isn't it? Oh god. Yeah, Nightmare just feels really good to play as. Holy crap. Even for a scrub like me. Uh oh. Dora Maxi killed a man. Somehow. With nunchucks. The man's like seven foot tall, by the way. I'll show it in a minute. I'll show it in a minute. Mother, I am ready. Battle one. Fight. Sword and show me the way. Don't say that, Shung Hua. I'm really bad at this game. I can fucking, I can fuck this up still. Don't. I don't care. I will spam my supers on him. My meter is not going down. I will spam. You must really like her. That's all I got to say. <laughs> this like this, the whole presentation of oh shit. Yeah. The whole presentation of this inferno fight is like definitely a a few generations removed from what it looked like in Soul Calibur 2. As much as I love Soul Calibur 2. I didn't think I was pretty much in it. Hey, I got him. I did it. <laughs> the fight seemed to be over, but alas, it was not.
It's okay. Yeah, I'm really bad at Street Fighter. I tried it on stream, you all remember that? That was real bad. Chun Lin, give me strength! Battle one. Fight! This is for my soul! We gotta be real close for that shit. My bad. That was pretty cool. That certainly explains how he can kill someone. He doesn't have to shove it up an ass. I don't even think Inferno has an ass, so... Max is gonna it. Too dangerous! <laughs> well, I guess it worked out. Yuga. What a waste. It's fine. Oh. Oh, we're doing this now. Shang-Hua, could you 
Hold on to it for me. What? But please. Okay. Uh, Thanks. I was Amazing. thinking about it, but great. Keelix workout routine, and also lack of nipples. All right. The swords once again left their mark on history, and still the march of fate continues onward. I ship it. Yeah, if nipples aren't a thing, why don't they just, like, not have Ivy wear anything up top? That should be fair game, right? We did it. We beat the game. <laughs> that was all of it. Yeah, it's not, like, the best story, but it's, again, far more than, um, it is, it is, like, way more than any story we have gotten in a Soul Calibur game prior to this, except for 5. But we don't talk about 5. We're not supposed to. Um, the <laughs> Monk Pirate Samurai Trio. Look, Dora, we've got the individual stories to go through. It could still happen. Because I totally forget what happens in those. Yeah, this story basically retold the, um... The story of Soul Calibur 1, apparently. But, um, like... No one knows what happened in Soul Calibur 1, because... It really wasn't in the game. Like, I played Soul Calibur 2, and I don't know what the fuck canonically happened in that game. Like, apparently Raphael was really important, but I didn't know anything about it. So, we'll see. Soul-edged game? I mean, yeah. But this game, the, like, Soul Edge was covered in the prologue to this story. They just were kind of like, yeah, Sophia, she killed Cervantes. We couldn't include two levels about that because that would be weird. And it's not like they include it in her side story either, which they, sh that, like, honestly, that would be kind of cool. Soul Calibur Six was like a reboot for the entire series, so. The story ever. <laughs> The individual stories, in my opinion, are a little bit more interesting than the main story. The main story is like, ah, kill the demon, but like, some of the, uh, some of the side stories are actually really interesting too. I remember Raphael's being really cool. Oh, cup of tea casting. Nice. Yeah, Tifa would fit better than Tekken. Cloud would definitely fit in this game. I really want another Nintendo... Like, I want them to do, like, a Soul Calibur... Um... On a Nintendo system again, so we can have a Nintendo guest. Like, because we could totally have someone from Fire Emblem now, you know? I thought about that when Soul Calibur 2 was out, because Shulk would actually be rad. Mio would be really cool too, actually. Because she has pretty unique weapons.
But yeah, I remember when Soul Calibur 2 was out. Like, it came out around Fire at the time Fire Emblem 7 came out. And I was like, dude, Hector would be awesome in this game. And I stand by that. Hector would be pretty awesome in the game. He could have played, like, Spawn, basically. Oh, also, one of the other obscure cameos in the Soul Calibur series. Uh, Lloyd Irving from Tales of Symphonia was in the spin-off Soul Calibur Legends. <laughs> it's me, Sir Spectres. It's me. Also, I just realized we have Grey Inspector and Sir Spectres. Is there relations? <laughs> we're, we're just like very spectral tonight. Wow, this is really long <laughs> credits for this game. The credits are still going. So I don't know, I, I like I said, I didn't really have a plan for this. And I don't know, character creation competition, hello? What? What happened? Um. Dude, I would play the shit out of that, Gran. I would play the shit out of that. It would be amazing. Um. But yeah, I really didn't have a uh, <laughs> square Enix for some reason. Um. Yeah, two B doesn't even have a Soul Chronicle entry. It's kind of, kind of, kind of bunk. Actually, I'm, I'm a little bit disappointed about it. Yes, it is. I, I understand that, but, like, it's random. The legend will never die. Oh. Yeah, the game doesn't tell you this, I guess. But, um, Shanghua's sword... It's Soul Calibur, by the way. <laughs> it was the Soul Calibur all along. Anyways, as I was saying, um, I didn't really have a plan for this. Um, I didn't know if it would become a series or whatever. Um, I could definitely, uh, you know. You know, I could definitely do more of this. Now that we know what we're in for, right? Now that y'all know how this works. These are basically just like shorter versions of... Um... You know, the main story that we just played. Do you, do you still want to see more of this and learn more about like more of the characters? I still think it's fun and worth doing. It, but you kind of know what we're getting now. Um, alternatively, there's still the, uh, the demos that I'd be interested in doing, and then, um, I'd still be, like, you know, because Resident Evil comes out at the end of next month, so I'd, I'm still interested in doing that. Um, so, I don't know. I guess I could, uh... I could keep going with this game until it comes out. It would probably last us that long, so.
So that could be what we do Thursday. Um, so yeah, and I mean I like that playing because it saves me money. Because I was like potentially gonna do like Metroid Prime or something before Resident Evil or. Part of me was like, fuck it, start firing them. But uh, we can talk about that later, I guess. Um, but this is actually where I'm going to end the stream for tonight because, like, clearly I am equipped to talk tonight. So, God, I need this to go away. I really need this to go away. Again, I think it. it like, it could be a cold. It's probably allergies, though, because it is very sinusy. And we have also had, like, the most... Sp I don't want to say spastic. Um, I don't know. The weather has been randomized around here <laughs> lately. Uh, we had a day that was... It, it, I got to, like, 70 the other day. And then the day after, it was uh, down in the 30s again. So that was real good. You know, it was it was it was disgusting. So. Yeah. Anyways, yeah, this is where I'm going to end the stream. Uh, I hope you all had a good weekend and I hope you all have a good week uh, coming up. So, yeah. I hope to see y'all Thursday. I guess we'll do more of this. Thanks for coming. It was a good, good turnout tonight. <laughs>